looking over their shoulders at the start of play. Villarreal are just two points above the relegation places. Only Real Betis separate them from the drop zone. Sevilla, meanwhile, are firmly ensconced in mid-table. It's unlikely that Champions League football will be achieved this season. While the threat of relegation lingers in the background, there should be enough daylight between themselves and the bottom two come the end of the season. It is those in yellow who need the points this afternoon. Take a look at the two sides for you, starting with Sevilla, and they've made two changes to the starting eleven, which began the 1-0 win against Huelva last time out. Both of those changes coming up front. Anna Franco and Tony Payne both come into the starting lineup. In Marc Abado and Jessica Martinez drop to the bench. Maria Martinez Madrona is the official for this one. She's in the middle. She did Villarreal 6 0 defeat at home to Levante a few weeks ago. And they'll be hoping that is not an omen this afternoon. Two captains, Calderon and Campo, leading their sides out this afternoon. And as we have a look at the visitors starting 11, they're unchanged from the side which got a much needed win last time out against Alaves. That was a huge three points for Sera Manafort's side. Sheila Guerrero scored the winner in that one and leads the line once again. She's their leading scorer in all competitions with eight goals. Gallardo giving chase. That's miscued. An opportunity. Martin Pieto scampering away from the challenge. Has San Pedro to her right hand side. Here's San Pedro now. Across the face of goal, and that is a really decent opportunity by Sevilla. Just couldn't quite get on the end of it. Here's Payne. Franco continuing her run towards the penalty spot. Payne gets it in, it's too high for Franco. He's underneath it now. Martin Prieto gets her shot away, claims of handball, and the referee has pointed to the spot. It was drilled in at pace from a close distance. Yeah, her left arm is out in an unnatural position. <laughs> Saved, followed up by Martin Prieto and over the bar and Villarreal survive. And Carmen Carbonell has kept Amanda San Pedro at bay. She guessed correctly. It was a comfortable height for Carbonell. Garcia plays the one-two and has Payne out wide. This is Payne and a Franco running into the area, busting a lung to get there. San Pedro trying to create space for the shot. Garcia with the ball in, and that is a fine fingertip save. Carmen Carbonell keeps them at bay once again. Rosa Ottoman to take this one. It's going to be an in-swinger with that left foot. It's a lovely ball in towards the far post, and guess who's there again? Carbonell with the save. Still not fully cleared. She's come. She's collected it the second time of asking. Ottoman's ball in. It was a lovely ball. Headed down into the ground by Yamas. One back by Payne. Here's San Pedro. Tony Payne in front of her, who has a chance to cross. Looking for Franco, spilled by Carbonell. Martin Prieto's there, Franco's there, and neither of them can get their shot away. 
Getting the cross in first time. Carbonell spilling it. Franco hooking it goalwards. Carbonell out of her goal. And Franco with the chance to finish. And Sevilla have taken the lead. Carmen Carbonell finally beaten in the Villarreal goal. They've had their chances. Carbonell kept them at bay in the first 45, but Anna Franco sends Sevilla on their way. And it was Villarreal playing them sells into all sorts of trouble and Carbonell who's been the player of the match so far with the mistake. Just a heavy touch, she was closed down by Martin Prieto who reacted quickest and had the presence of mind to pick out Anna Franco. Possibly the final act. It's come all the way through, cleared off the line. That could have been two, but it's all academic because the final whistle goes. Four wins in five matches now for Sevilla. Christian Toro's side are unbeaten in five. Carmen Carbonell, the Villarreal keeper, going from hero in the first half to villain in the second. She saved a penalty from San Pedro in the first 45 minutes, but then her mistake, 10 minutes into the second half, allowed Anna Franco to open the scoring. It's a defeat for Sarah Manafort and her side, who now have just one win in eight in all competitions. They are nervously looking over their shoulders. Carmen Carbonell being comforted after the error. A solitary goal from Anna Franco, enough for the victory. It's finished in Liga FA, match day 18, Sevilla 1, Villarreal 0.